Okay, I know what it is. Well, at least I think I know what it is. <coughs> what happened was, yesterday, I was uploading the uh, video. I was uploading the video, and for some reason, YouTube decided to have some kind of fucking glitch take a shit. So when I went to upload the video, it locked up. It said it was uh, unable to do it, blah, blah, blah. Well, I set it to upload right now. It's got 18 minutes left. We're at 70%. That's what's going on. I'm uploading the video and streaming at the same time. <clears throat> That's what's going on. I'll tell you what we'll do. I'll try to get the shout outs done. And, well, I will. And we'll just fuck around a little bit. And then hopefully, we're at, like I said, we're at 71% now. Hopefully, it will upload the video from last stream. And we will live happily ever after. Okay, that's my fault. That's operator error. But I knew something was going on. I dropped 26 frames, 0.2. Four percent of uh, so far, son of a bitch. Yeah, I was at. Uh, was that off the screen? Thirty-eight hundred, forty-six hundred, thirty-seven hundred, forty-two hundred kilobits per second. Yeah, that's definitely what's going on. All right, well. <sighs> No rest for the wicked, right? All right, what were we doing? We were in situation. We were we were having a situation. Size is not everything. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Maybe. Yoda, you little pervert. Your skills are complete. No, they're not. Uh, ooh. Ooh. People who really want to have a good time won't come to a slaughterhouse. That's true. I've seen some pretty shitty situations in my life, but nothing has ever sucked more ass than this. <laughs> That's so funny. <clears throat> well, don't be afraid to tell me how you really feel, Billy Bob. not much on that for the height I just adjusted my chair I'll tell you what else we got going on here this um, this chair that I'm using it's supposed to correct your posture you know whatever it's got me folded in here like a damn accordion it's hard on the old on the old shins and on the old knees so what I did is I got a couple of these kneeling pads and I put those down and those seem to be helping a little bit. They're not great. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hear you. I shouldn't have got up. I had it where I wanted it, didn't I? That's about right there. Hmm. Maybe that needs to go up. That's better. All right, if you didn't love me the first time, you can't love me again, but you need to love me again. You better love me again. And I apologize. These things happen. Hey, I'm flying. 
got caught. Oh, for fuck's sake. I guess if you want anything done, you gotta do it yourself, don't you? I can see if I want anything done around here, I gotta do it myself. That sounds about right. made an absolute mess of everything so just be prepared be prepared ladies and gentlemen let me get a drink here there's no alcohol in this yet but it is water I continue my workout even though I didn't have to did 21 good push-ups. I feel pretty good about that. Let me put this. I don't know if I like that. that. All right, we're gonna try this. Welcome, everybody, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages over 18, thousands in attendance, and millions watching around the world. Welcome to the greatest dumpster fire on earth. I'm your host, Jumpsuit Sniper. Be your guide through this, what we call a show tonight. Uh, for those of you who just joined us, what's going on is I'm uploading my video that should have been uploaded earlier to Twitch, and it had an error. I went to go shut the computer down. It's all fucked up. So I said, okay, no problem. I can I can upload a video before we start the next session. Sure you can. Sure you can. Let's see where we're at. We're at 80%. All right. <clears throat> Hopefully it won't be too bad. Johnny, pump action! And look at that. Look at that. You've got six symbols in there. Look at you. Look at you. Okay, you got you got Johnny, you got O'Malley, you got J Dub, you got Old Man, you got Core, and you got the Hitman. How about that? Wow. Look at you. Uh, yeah. No, you can't. Nobody can. Nobody can. It's not allowed. Johnny, pump action. Let's see what you're up to. Let's see what you're up to. Assetto Corsa. All right. <clears throat> Man. Hey, we got to give some shout outs here. Hopefully this goddamn thing will be done uh, uploading to uh, YouTube and it won't give me another error in the next few minutes. We'll have it then. Let's shout out the Irish bloke, shall we? Uh, I was watching him earlier than yesterday afternoon uh his stream looks so much better he got a new mic and it sounded better but his push to talk wasn't working quite right so we got to get that figured out but you could hear him on the uh, on the stream audio capture you could hear the truck noise in the background so much better the video looked pretty good so as soon as he gets his mic uh, squared away, I think we'll be good. Maybe he's already got it done. The Irish bloke, everyone. And uh, let's see here. We got a shout out. Let us game 100. Thank you, Anna. 
Phasmophobia, let's go. Irish and Anna make, made the, the intros and outros and intermissions and all that good stuff. Okay, where are we at here now? Well, Craig's already shouted himself out as a good... As a good moderator who who may or may not need to wait <clears throat> on someone to shout them out. Well done, Craig. Well done. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Ah, I know who I'm missing. The real Nord Wolf. That's who I'm missing. There we go. He's playing New World. A whole new world. Sing it. Come on, sing it, Johnny. You know you want to. All right, ubiquitous with the follow. Uh, how about that Shevel misfit? Damn straight, we can shout her out. M-I-S. There we go. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Do it. Sally face? Shiva, are you seriously playing Sally face? Fuck my life. Alright, whatever. Voodoo. Voodoo with the follow. Legionnaire with the follow. Antonio with the follow. People Hernandez with the raid. Come on. Come on. Give me what you got. Oh, I spelled your name. I spelled your name wrong. God damn it. Well, we're gonna try this again then. Her Nan Dez. Let's try that now. GTA 5, let's go. Lady Death Willow with the follow. Room pay with the follow. And that's that's the extent of it for you. Well, that's not. Thank you to my moderators. And thank you for everyone who hosted. And rated that doesn't show up in the feed. Thank you very much. Well, thank you very much. Can I be in charge for a while? I don't have that soundbite, I don't think. I don't think I have that. I have it downloaded, but I don't have it. Well, thank you very much. Uh, well, okay, I have. Sh shut up. Okay, so I got the first part of it. All right. Stop riding me. Don't make fun. We don't judge here. Huh. Except when we're being judgmental. Then we judge. Oh, for fuck's sake. Let's see what we got going here. Okay. Uh, we are going to not continue. We're going to go to multiplayer and le let's see what's going on. Let's go to favorites. Let's refresh. Go forward and then back. Yeah. See, look at this. 107 ping on the dam. It should be like down about 77. It's my own fault. It's my own fault for loading that up. Um, that uh, to uh, YouTube. Well, actually, it's YouTube's fault. Let's blame it on YouTube. Can we do that? I'd like to blame it on someone other than myself. We're going to be on the dam 2.0 tonight if we can get in. Let's go ahead and see if we can connect. I am not going to make a new character. Fuck that shit. See how much time we got left on this. 88%. Eight minutes is what they're telling me. We'll see. I'm not sure I'm trusting this at all. Damn 2.0, let's go. Well, I'm in a garage with a truck. Okay. Uh, what garage am I in? I thought, Craig, I thought that I was at the gas station. I'm not at the gas station. I went somewhere else. Where the hell did I go? Because if I were at the gas station, I'd have that brick wall in front of me. Let's look out the window and see if we can figure out where we're at. Hmm. I think I'm up in the mountains somewhere. I, I swear I don't remember. I mean, it'll come back to me, I'm pretty sure, but I don't remember where I'm at. You ever woke up in a garage without your underwear? She's not wearing any. You ever done that? 
Yeah. It happens. There's some 9mm bullets at 45%. I don't think I'm going to take those. I don't even know where I am right now. Do I have a screwdriver? Oh, I hear puppets outside. That's not good. Um, no, 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 no. You're all right. You're fine. I just don't remember where I'm at. Oh, I know where I'm at now. I'm in B. I'm in B2. I'm in B2. That's where I'm at. I looked at the the uh, garage across the street here, and that's what kind of jogged my brain. Ooh, now, is it? I think it's getting light. I forgot to check to see what time it was. I still need a baseball bat. Is that a dirt bike? There's a dirt bike over there. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, well, you tell him that you just talked to an admin and the red zones are the only PvP zones. <clears throat> and the, uh, I never even put a lock on there. I never even put a lock on there, I guess. All right, I'm an idiot. Yeah, we had, we had problems with that. I was reading in the Discord. Uh, so keep that in mind. You'll just have to check with the admins who are on. Do I not have locks? Maybe I don't have any locks. What I should do is fix up that dirt bike and go ramming around. Uh, base rating. Um... Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yes. You can raid a base. And you can steal cars. Okay, the PvP with no retribution for KOS is only in the red zones. Okay, so I'm going to repeat that. On the other server, on MB... It is no KOS except in the red zones. The red zones are KOS. You can steal and you can base raid, at least last I knew, anywhere on the map, but you have to deal with the repercussions from that. All right? Let me get, I'm gonna get out of this town here. I think it's starting to get light. I don't I'm gonna see if I have a lock somewhere. I'm gonna go for a lock on this. I talked to more about it. I told him it wasn't at the top of my list of having that available for PvP. But anyway, I said it's your server, you, you, you know, do with it what you want. Do I have any locks? I got no locks. I can build a lock. I might have a lock in here. Okay, here's a lock. What am I doing carrying duct tape around? I got nothing. I got one on the truck. Why am I not? What am I doing? What have I done with my life? Okay, I've got, I got stuff here in my inventory that I don't even know why I'm carrying it. I got nine millimeter ammo, and here I am carrying a 357 Magnum. See that? I'm all ate up. I got improvised rope on me. Why? I got this wire. Was I just going out and being a loot goblin? That sounds so unlike me. I don't think that, hmm, that's not accurate at all. Uh, we got some 99% guts here. Can I interest you in that? Got a needle. 
Wait a minute. Am I? Do I have sausages? I still got sausages in here at 82 and 85 percent. I don't even know why I'm carrying this shit, guys. I I apologize. I got improvised rope. I got barbed wire. Okay, I know why I got the barbed wire. Cause I want I'm wanting a baseball bat. I found this hundred out of hundred grinding stone. How about that? I do remember that. That was a big deal. Let's put these grenades somewhere else. I feel like if those grenades got into the wrong hands, it could be bad. Um, so the question is here, why am I still carrying duct tape? I don't think I need it. Uh, and I got this bottle of wine. I got this Kikomon here. Let's see. You guys are going to have to, well, you don't have to give me, but you should give me a moment to figure out just what the fuck I'm doing. And, okay. Truth, truth. All right. Full disclosure, it's probably going to take me longer than a moment to figure out what the fuck I'm doing. And why am I carrying feathers when I've got two and a half dozen arrows? I don't know. But I'm going to find out. We're going to get to the bottom of this. Look, there's more duct tape. Do I not? I've got knives. I wasn't going to make knives. I think I was being just a goddamn loot goblin. Craig, I think I was just being a loot goblin. I was just doing what loot goblins do, I guess. I've got these gold locks here. Let's do something crazy. Let's do something crazy. Uh... One, two, three, four. All right. Is it getting lighter or is it getting darker? What the hell's going on? All right. What we're going to do, because that is a spawn point up there, which surprised me. Or either that or somebody's dropped one off, which that is also entirely possible. Somebody could have dropped one off, but I think that's a spawn point. I've found a motorcycle there before. All right, here we go. There's no side door on this one. Let's, uh, one, two, and three, just for the hell of it. And then let's open up. We're going to put this truck in here in a minute. Oh, my God, did that motorcycle despawn? Okay, let me get this repair kit. I think I had a repair kit. Yeah, right here. Let's go see how much that needs. It's not taken. Ooh, baby. It's going to need some gas. Let's fix that up. Let's see what we got to now. 96%, that's good enough. Ooh, there's a puppet. Do I have any gas in the truck? All right, here's, this is something that could be in real life. I could just as easily go get the gas can out, but I'm not gonna do that. I'll show you what we're gonna do. God damn it. Oh God. Can we not make it out the door? Are you kidding me? Hmm. Well, this is going to be an issue. Can we back it in? driver my ass actually it might fit a little bit better this way 
think it actually is going to. As long as I can get the doors closed and get out. Ooh, I can. All right, so we've what have we learned, ladies and gentlemen? Okay, you can have two vehicles on this server. I'm going to go ahead and lock off this dirt bike. Now, let's drive this bitch. Let's see how we do. I don't have far to go. Let's go to the gas station. She's flying. Oh, there's puppets up here on the road. I thought it was a player at first. Little Red Riding Hood don't like that. I'm going to tell you, if there's a mob, they will knock you off. They will knock you off, and they will kill you. So keep that in mind. And there is beeper damage at all the gas stations now. <sighs> and there are puppets here. We got Little Red Riding Hood here. I'm just waiting to hear beep, 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 beep. You can take him out. There's the beep that I was waiting for. He's fast, too. Guys, ever since they did the last update, these fucking puppets are fast and they are ferocious. They are mean. They are nasty. Don't get mixed up in it. Kind of hard being on Scum Island, isn't it? Is that a player? Oh, he killed the bird! You fucker. Don't let Feudal see that. You killed one of his corvids. Uh oh. I gotta get back up here. Close. Surprise, motherfucker! Kingy! I'm hoping. I'm almost out of gas. I'm almost out of gas. I'm hoping I can get up here and at least get off this before it runs out of gas. Get up here in position with the gas pumps. All right, we're good. Watch your back, because there's a few of them out here. There's one right there. We'll come back and loot this here in a minute. What's up, Big Stan? Or, no, this is a fishing guy. Yeah, even if you're going fast, if there's a bunch of them, they'll take you out. I wonder if the beeper blew up these others. <clears throat> now, I have advanced driving, but I don't think I have hardly any skill in the um, motorcycle arena, Kingy. Shit, how did that get damaged just then? Oh my god, where'd you come from? Holy shit, did you see that? They leaped down from somewhere. He was on top of something. Did you see that? He was on top of something and he leaped down. Uh, other people I've talked to have said, like, they're up on top of buildings. Like, how the fuck did you get up there? Do not trust that puppets don't climb up. Remember, the, it was either the last time we were here or on another server. A puppet leaped right up here on top of this white contractor's trailer. <clears throat> Kingy! Kingy, what? What are you doing? Why are you trying to gamble all your money away? What is going on? I'm hearing some stuff in the background. He's got a 6% rubber strip on him. 
What do I have to chop with? Give me that. Give me that shitty knife. The hunter. Ninety-nine percent of me losing and one percent win. Okay. Well, all right. Um, if that's how you feel about it. I know that I like this setup. I don't know that I like this thing quite as much. Now it's my right shoulder that's bothered. My right shoulder blade. Okay, there's a puppet in there on the floor. Um, what's up, fool? I got something for you. Well, hold still. Oh, that was so close. Really? A no, there is no chopper. Not tell what. Oh. Yes, there is. No! I see what this is. This is a conspiracy. This is a conspiracy to commit chopper. Whoa. Hello. Yeah, we didn't even go through all this stuff. She's just going to drop trial right here. Hope nobody minds. Hope nobody minds, she's just gonna drop trial right here. God, I don't like that. You like that better? I don't know, maybe. Why can I not put the bow in my hands? There we go. Shut up! All right, can I have my arrow back? Whoa, I gotta get it from the outside, evidently. All right, we'll take that. We'll put this over here. This is gonna be, uh, oh, 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 right. You didn't have enough points. I was gonna say, no, we can't do that till Whitefire gets here. But of course, we all know what's happened now, don't we? Don't we? We know what happened. All right, I see what you guys are doing. This is a goddamn conspiracy. Mm. Look at that. A hundred money. Oh, yeah, we're taking that. Uh, oh, you've just been lurk. You've been lurking in the shadows, haven't you? Let's see how this works. I'm starting to pick up what you're laying down. We're using the bushman on this, this girl. There's a whole lot of fat there. Huh. I can't imagine what could have possibly woken you up. Look at this. We're going to take another knife. 81% on the spices. Let's go. We got 81% spices. Uh, oh, right. My ping for going live. Yeah, it was horrible. Horrible. I'm going to try not. I'm going to try not to upload a video while I'm trying to stream. I imagine that was somewhat taxing on my system. Uh, what notification bell? You mean that one? Oh God. It's time for choppy choppy. Let's go. <laughs> Survey set! There's a wolf out there. I heard it. I just heard a wolf just now. Hear it? Are you guys hearing that? Uh, what's your YouTube? Uh, I don't know. Let's take a look. Hold on. It should be done. I think it's done. There's definitely wolves right out here. It says it's 100% uploaded. Processing will begin shortly. Okay. Fine. Fucking do it then. Do it! What do I got in here on 
There's something going on here. Hold on. What's this all going on? Okay, somebody got stuck in a roof. There's multiple wolves here. I'm telling you, I can hear them. There's at least two. They are close. This is a wolf spawn area. Just north of here. I reckon I ought to have a cup of coffee. Mm -hmm. Alright. Um, do I want that bread? I don't know. I guess I'm going to take it. White fire. What happened to you? You got so many symbols. You use too many symbols. You're in so much trouble. Let's see what's in this chow mein. It's got moisture in it. Four portions. 52 calories. Hmm. Uh, seven is the max, yeah. <clears throat> Who just raided? Not Kingy coming in with the raid. Thank you, Not Kingy. I'm sure we've shouted out Not Kingy at least once tonight already, but let's just go ahead and do it again. Uh, at Not Kingy. We can shout out Nightbot, too. Okay, there we go. Playing scum. Uh, I, I don't have... I don't know what we're doing. I'm trying not to get killed by wolves, I think. Oh, we'll take that thread. Thank you very much. You gotta pick up the thread. Thread is life. Thread is life. Oh, what's that out there? Let's go see what's going on. Seems like it's been trying to get light. Let's go see where these wolves are. I see him. No, I don't see him. I hear him. What I'm trying to say is they're here. Here, come up here and just eat some of this puppet carcass. Seriously, just eat some of this par puppet carcass. You'll be fine. You don't need any fresh, juicy, live specimens here. Just eat the puppet. I know I heard him. Oh, sweet, sweet mother of pearl. They've respawned already. What I want to do is see the puppets chase the wolves, or the wolves attack the puppets. I really want to see that. Holy shit, look at them all! Lord have mercy! And there's a beeper. You know what? This gas station is getting a little hot for me. Let's just get the fuck out. Now who's raiding? Oh my god, White Fire Gaming just coming in with the raid. Oh, you just had to do it, didn't you? You just had to do it. There you go, Code Vein. What the hell? I don't think I'm dropping any more frames, yet, but we'll see. I know what a mud vein is. Does that count? Is it too much to ask for a baseball bat? I mean, really. Where's the best spot to find one? Where's the lock chunk cars? Hey, I know where we're gonna go where we haven't been in a long time. Seriously, this is where we're going. Train station train uh Beastie Are you saying that's where there's a lot of junk cars? 
Maher, thanks for the follow. Um, are you saying that's where there's a lot of junk cars? All right, well, you're on kind of the right track. Let's go here first on the dirt bike. Totally unprepared. Look at all these crackheads. And there was a beeper in there too. There was a beeper in that mix. <clears throat> well, I hope it's, oh shit, I hope it's not me. I wanna see where her skill's at because she had no motorcycle skills whatsoever earlier. It's quite a grind. You know where I'm going, don't you? Whoa, whoa, what did I just see? I think this must be what the admins were talking about. They built a ramp here to jump over. Now that, that's new. That's something new. What the fuck is that? Well, of course we're going to have to try this. See, I told him it could be done. I fucking told him it could be done. <clears throat> oh, maybe not. Nope, I'm only up to 62 skill. I'm no evil Knievel. Let's see where we're at here. Cause that cracked, that just, that did some damage. That did some wham, bam, van damage. My bladder, I'm gonna have to take a piss here in a minute. Watermelon? I've been eating watermelon? Things are just getting completely out of control here. All right, hold on. I'm at 3% of motorcycling towards medium. I didn't remember any of that. Okay, 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 because I didn't re-roll this character. That's what's going on. All right, let's just start at the beginning. Brawling is uh, basic and almost a half milli. Is advanced. Archery is medium and a little. Rifles medium and a little handgun medium and a little constitution we're working on our running evidently uh that's taken for fucking ever endurance is medium dex driving is medium okay that makes sense motorcycling is basic and a little thievery is basic and a little stealth is basic and a little intelligence well after that last maneuver maybe not uh, medical is basic and a half, and that's about as good as it's going to get. I think medical is going to take for fucking ever to grind. Uh, hold on while I scratch my back. This is, this is important. All right, what were we doing? Okay, so sniping, survival, awareness, and engineering are all medium. Camouflage is basic. All right, fine, fine. We gotta have a toolbox now. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Hey, I don't know if anybody has done this, but we're gonna take a piss right on the ramp. My girl is gonna squat right here and take a piss on the ramp. Somebody has put in, been putting way too much time and energy into this, into this ramp here, but Hey, everybody's got to be something, right? All right, now, does she have to poop? No, she doesn't have to poop. Evidently, I've got plenty of energy and plenty of moisture. Plenty of water at this time. Let's, oh, 77. God dang it. I got a toolbox, but no car repair kit. 
Let's go see if we can find a car repair kit over here at the garage. Come on, baby. At least I have some motorcycle skills. Can I ramp this? A little bit. I guess that's gonna be, oh shit on me. There's puppets here already. There's usually a beeper right down here somewhere. Hmm. This is gonna be a problem. See if I can sneaky sneaky in here. Okay. I don't think I can jump, but I'm gonna try it. Ooh, so close. Well, no shit. You just smashed right into the side of a container, dummy. <clears throat> Surprise, motherfucker! Now, there's a Black Hawk crossbow, but I'm not taking it. I will move it, though. I like to move it, move it! Come on. Put it there. This is a PvE server, so we shouldn't have too much trouble. Let's check this out. You know where I went, where I found, what did I, no, I found bows. That's what I found. She's pulling 80. Let's go ahead and smoke this dude right here if we can. Ooh, he, that's a beeper. I might be able to sneak right in this bitch. Take that screwdriver. I don't know what I'll do if I find a cargo drop, but oh, I'll take another screwdriver. <clears throat> a yellow and black one would be nice right now. Hello. I'm not taking those. I'll leave them for somebody else. I will take a yellow and black screwdriver if I find one though. That's gonna happen. Don't want no goddamn parking sensor. Or two goddamn parking sensors. Or three goddamn parking sensors. I think we're good on the fuel cans here, kids. The six out of ten wire. Nope. Nope. Look at all these gas cans. Let's see if I can sneaky sneaky in here. Come on, give me a car repair kit. Ah. Ask and ye shall receive. And it's at 80%. I don't know how many units are on it, though. Just remember, when you find them other places than in the cargo drop, the odds are it's not going to be a 100 out of 100 car repair kit. Okay? Holy sweet Jesus. we got to make room for that. Eight out of ten wire, no thank you. Eight out of ten wire, no thank you. I was finding the eight out of ten wires like everywhere. It was a curse. We finally broke it the other day. 
Look at this. A 46. All right, let's see what this one is. That's 50. All right, as much as I like to hoard these, I'll leave this for the next person. First of all, I can't carry it. Uh, another 8 out of 10. What do you know? Second of all, <clears throat> I like to leave it, leave it. <clears throat> and actually, what I should do, I'll take this other screwdriver. I'm not even going to need all that, so I will leave this kit in hand. Uh, I think I will. There. I'll take the lesser one. See what a nice guy I can be. Don't spread that around. Everybody will want one. There's a puppet there. And what I'll do is I'll put this car repair kit over here in the shed or something. Once I repair the motorcycle. Talk about flying by the seat of your pants, man, because you can't store anything in this. All right, that's got 23 left on it. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay. This will be a little sneaky sneak because you never find car repair kits. fit up there? How about on the floor? There. Sneaky, sneaky. This is a pretty common place. Somebody will be coming down here. I'll find it. I could shoot. Hey, what's my archery at? Archery's at 14% towards advanced. So I've got 140,000 in archery, right? 144,723. She's carrying 46 kilograms right now. Damn, my girl's thick! She's going to have to pee again before too long. All right, what we're going to do... Ooh, what we're going to do... Get on that, bitch. Get on your bad motor scooter and ride. We're going to actually try to avoid the Noid. Some of these puppets. We're going to go to these junk cars over here on the other side. If I drive fast enough, maybe they'll just ignore me. We'll pretend like they don't exist, right? If a bunch of them come after me, I am so, so in trouble. I've got a bow and a sledgy. I guess I do have my pistol. You know what? We're going to park this bike where we can make a run for it if we have to. Uh, Kingy, I probably did know that. I just didn't remember it. But thank you so much for sharing. Because evidently my show isn't educational enough. So people need to learn additional facts. Well, <clears throat> I don't think that I knew that. Oh, there's a repair. That's a weapon cleaning kit. I'm taking that. I'll have to make room for I don't care if I have to make room for it. We're taking it. Can I put it in the combat boots? Almost you could. Yeah, we're making room for that. Holy parking sensors, Batman. Uh, 
Uh, there's a Ballista 100. I did not know. Uh, that's a lie. Prostitution is the oldest profession in the world. I can assure you on that one. <clears throat> Dentistry is not. Oh, look. There's a dead bird right there. He, he killed that bird. You are not finding any birds. Get down. He's down too. <clears throat> yeah, so I'm going to call bullshit on that one, Kingy. That is not the oldest profession in the world. Give me a little something, something. I'll trade you three crickets and a larvae. Ho! What's up, Shirley? What's up, bitch? Oh, here comes another one. All right. Ooh. Though that guy was chasing a bird, too, evidently. Oh, God, I hear a beaver. See, he just ran off. Look, he's smacking at on the ground yeah I I do not know how to pronounce it but they did it allegedly uh, to promote tourism or something like that is why they did that and and the guy rattled it off it's, it's stupid it's a stupid thing to do in my opinion but it worked. Relax. Yep. Yeah, it's it's some bullshit. Now I'm hearing some kind of scratchy. Is that coming from my cell phone? Of course, you know your cell phone listens to you, right? <clears throat> it's awfully coincidental how I I will talk about something on a stream, and then I will go to like to Yahoo or uh, YouTube or Amazon. And something related to what I was just talking about will pop up. Awfully interesting, isn't it? Privacy, my ass. It's a bunch of bullshit. They know it, you know it, I know it. Oh my goddamn arrow. That's right. What are you holding, bitch? Let's go number six. Big Brother is always watching, and they try to deny it. Oh, we would never do anything. Bullshit. It's more like you would always. It's not. It's the opposite of never. Oh, oh, you got that one wrong. Yeah, right. You got that answer wrong. It's actually the opposite of never, meaning always. I'm going to scoot this chair back and see if I like that any better. I'm probably not going to like it any better, but whatever. A puppet. I have time to fix my boots before I get smacked. Not bloody likely. Pretty good loot down here, though. So we found that bow, that was a hundred pound ballista, 
which I could take, but I'm not going to th uh, willingly throw down the compound bow for a ballista. Okay, here's a Predator 70. So we'll pull that out. So we found two bows already down here. So if you're looking for some bows, at least on this server, uh, I have not. I have not. Hey, did we, uh, we gave you, did we give you a shout out, Beastie? I know I thought about doing it. That might have been as far as it got. Oh, right, okay, I got you. I am curious why I didn't see those wolves up there at the gas station, but they were, I definitely heard them. Guys, I'm a little bit groggy yet, getting uh, used to the sleep schedule. <clears throat> hold on, hold on, hold on. Playing no game. Perfect. It's the best game on here. It's absolutely the best. You're simply the best! Do I have scissors on me already? Yes, I do. How about some of this money? Ten money, you broke such and such. Bitch better have my money, comp. I'm telling you. Whoa, we got one. We got a live one here. I just saw him go behind that bush. Where you at, you fucker? Man, that's a fast one, too. Too bad we couldn't put a bird in between us or something. Alright, got a big Stan here. He's leaping. <coughs> leaping lizards, big Stan. <coughs> Yeah, we put the smack on him. Ah! I got my rhythm off. She smoked that little skinny fucker with one hit. My girl's. Hey! Bada 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 so we Hey! Bada 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 so Kennedy, 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 so we Bada. She's four and a half straight. She don't fuck around. Bleeding slightly. Bundle, 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 taking hands, cut up this guy, cut the right ships. Uh, I would like 10 minutes into the future, King. Thank you. Hundred and fifty years into the future, the odds are I will not still be alive. So selfishly, I don't think I care. But I do care about what happens ten minutes into the future. Now, I guess the what's really gonna bake your noodle is would I have the ability to change anything? Hmm? How about that? So anybody who hasn't come down here to check out uh, the um, rather lose your sight or your memories. Fuck, I've lost memories already. I would rather lose my memories, I think. I don't think I'd want to be blind. It's bad enough as it is. I thought about that in the past. If you had to lose one of your senses, 
Which one would it be? Would you want to lose your sense of taste, smell, touch, hearing, sight, or what if you don't have a choice uh, out of all of them? For example, you can either lose your hearing or your sight. Which one? Hmm. <laughs> right. Your senses. Yeah, thank you. Well done. Well played. Golf clap. Golf clap. Aye, they. Uh, aye, they. I got a sound bite for you. You just hold on. Um, let's see. Where's it at? Here we go. Come on. Play it. What was that? It was bad. It, it had nothing. No fire, no energy, no nothing. You know I have a shoulder right here, you know? Hmm? Hmm? And it must pop, pop, pop. So tomorrow from five to seven, will you please act like you have more than a two word vocabulary? It must be green, okay? Okay? Okay. Okay, we've done this row. Oh my god. I should be careful with my injuries. Did I do... I, I didn't do all these already, did I? Did I do this whole row and forgot about it? No. Okay, I was getting there, and then I was rudely interrupted. I remember that now. You, Lock and Seagull. You know why we're here? Yes, I do know why you're here. Two bows, a hundred pound and a seventy pound. I hear a puppet coming. Yep, I heard him. I got something for you. Oh, you want some more of this? I missed my baseball bat though. Uh, Nutella or maple syrup? Wow. I like them both, really. I like them both a lot. I guess the no the Nutella, because it's got a little bit of oil in it, I could probably get free. That maple syrup sets up, it'll be rock hard. Well, the, the Nutella does too. You're really putting me on the spot here, Kingy. Come on, come on, come on, quickly, 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 quickly. Oh my God. What are they chasing? Look at them. I thought they were coming after me. They're killing that bird. There ain't, there's not hardly one live bird on the whole place. Look at this. On the whole reservation. I'm trying to fuck some shit up over there now. Look, the bird got away. Why did I not kill that dude? Why am I not killing him? Okay, he's down. Did you see that? I rescued my first bird. They didn't get it killed. All right now, where's this other dude at? Oh, look at him. He's running clear up there on the hill. You guys can't see it, but he's right up there. See him by the tree through the fence? That's a heavy, too. Let's see if I can hit him from here. He's down, bitches! Die in 20 years with no regrets or live to 100 with a lot of regrets. Uh, I'd be 70 with no regrets or live to 100 with a lot of regrets. That means 30 years more to have to live with myself regretting shit. Fuck that. I'll die in 20 years, thank you. That's what I say right now, then. Anyway... These puppets chasing birds are crazy. Where are we at here? Where's the dead body? I'll take the arrows. I smoked that fool. Okay, there's his body right there. 
Give me a cricket and a grub. Go away, snitch bot. Snitch bot, you're pissing me off. Do I even have a pistol? Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. Where you at, fool? You best be getting out of here. Because we got the 357 Magnum. With the red dot on it. Hell yeah. Don't fuck with mommy. Alright, what you holding? Nothing? Travel the world for free for a year or have 50000 to spend however you want. Well, <clears throat> how do you know I don't already have 50000 to spend however I want? <sighs> let's, uh, let's put it this way, Kingy. As long as I can travel the world for free with no complications, okay? I would travel the world for free for the next year with no complications. If there are complications, then I'll just take the money and I'll spend it traveling however I want. Or maybe not. I'll just throw it in a bank account and just hoard it. Okay, where is this puppet I killed? He's over here. Somewhere. I'm going to have to pee here in a few... Oh, look at that. Look at that. I knew I was in the vicinity. What am I what am I doing here? I think my girl's gotta pee again. See this? I was I was saying this. It's not anything new, but my girl squats to pee, whereas if you have a dude, he grabs his dick and stands up and leans back. So if you're on a PvP server, you may not want to have a male character. Okay? Got somebody that's got a squat to pee, that's kind of important right now. So what happened is, the dude was over 50 meters from me, I reckon, okay? He was over 50 meters from me, so his body despawned, but the arrows stayed, all right? Some serious shit that we got to consider here. Um... Did I get all those cars looted down there? Are my injuries healed? Is my dirt bike still here? don't want beepers. I really don't want to get gang raped here either. Oh, fuck that. I said I specifically did not, did not want beepers. Hey, and did you notice this? Those puppets came outside the gate chasing that bird. They came outside the fence. Let's, uh, I'll put you guys on the Be Right Back screen, and I'm going to go potty, and then I'll be right back. I might get a snack. Here we go. Talk amongst yourselves. <laughs>
All right. Hundred dollar bill floating in a public toilet or a twenty dollar bill in your own pocket. Uh, I'll take the hundo. I can clean that shit. Paragon. Paragon's come in and left. I thought it sounded like somebody was taking off with my dirt bike. Hold on a second, I gotta put a little gotta put a little something in a little something something here. Welcome, Paragon. I guess hi and hi and goodbye. Uh, these things happen. Alright, I'm gonna put my water in here. Get some of that cold water. Bring me the head of a pig and something cool to drink. Yeah, I'm not even moving, but I would say this, the throttle on the dirt bike, you know, end of the world kind of shit, scumbags, it might, the carburetor might flutter a little bit. I'm assuming this is not fuel injected. Well, it could, it could be fuel injected. Got it. I was looking at dirt bike prices the other day. I was looking at a T, TW200, huh? Alright, hold on. Sorry, guys. You probably wanted that screen. I think I can pick up a used one for a couple grand. But I'm thinking pretty seriously about a side by side. I don't know. I'm gonna tell you when I got married there were only four or five of us there let's see the judge the preacher because he had to unlock the church I was not gonna get married by a preacher it was so cold it was 11 11 11 that should have been an indication right there but anyway huh judge that married us, my wife at the time, me, my little sister who took pictures in the priest room. There were five there. I didn't want people at the wedding. Weddings are overrated. Anyway, I was going to say something else that's really crap, but I'm not going to. About something else that's overrated. If I had a funeral, I'd be dead, so I wouldn't care if anybody showed up at my funeral or not. So I guess... I care about the wedding and the funeral about the same, which is not at all. <clears throat> have all traffic lights you approach be green or never have to stand in line again? I'll take that never have to stand in line again. And of course, not because I'm dead or something sinister like that. It's just that, like... If we went to the amusement park, which I probably would never do again, but unless we went with the kids, uh, we are on server number one. No shit. Well, you know, it's like the dad jokes and stuff. We've got Kingy. And Kingy does contribute quite a bit to the, uh, to the stream. Sometimes... He contributes things that I would rather him not contribute, but overall, it's positive. Has anybody ever found a baseball bat up in a hunting stand? There's one right up here. Let's go check the hunting stand. Mm. 
I'm gonna tell you something else I've been dying to do. Here's the problem. Now that I'm looking for a baseball bat, I can't find one to save my ass. But I'll keep looking. <clears throat> I'll keep looking. Irish! The Irish bloke would, uh, actually, uh, Craig's in here, if he's so inclined. Or you can make Irish shout himself out. We shouted you out earlier, buddy. <clears throat> For sure we did. 100%. Um, I need to tell you guys this. For any of you who are watching that uh, haven't heard it. Thank you, Greg. I want to drive th through the shooting range. No, that is not. But I wanted to do this. I have not driven through the shooting range on a dirt bike ever. Now... This opens up some possibilities. By the way, Irish has a server called The Tank. I can advertise a little bit more liberally on this server. <clears throat> it's called The Tank. Uh, you're PVE only right now, is that correct, Irish? Um, it's brand new, he's still doing some work on it, getting his stream set up and all that, but if you feel like it, please uh, go over and check that out. The Tank. It's a UK server. So those of you from the UK would probably have a better ping than what I had. Uh, the Irish server was taken. I don't know. That's up to him. Now this is something that I think would be fun. Not on a PvE server. But you have an agreement. And here's how it works. You get your buddies to ride around on dirt bikes out here at the shooting range. Okay, get your buddies to ride on dirt bikes out here, and you guys take turns shooting at each other at known distances. Well, hello, my little crackheads. See that? You know this is 50. That's 100. Oh, shit. You know that's 100. Blah, blah, blah. 200. And run back and forth like a damn shooting gallery with real live targets if you wanted to practice shooting at moving targets. Now, wouldn't that be a great idea? Oh, you mean you could do it. You could do it on foot as well. But I'm going to tell you, those of you who are going to level up your motorcycle skills, your running skills, it, it takes a lot of time. It's grinding. Uh, I was in O'Malley's stream earlier, uh, well, yesterday, and we were talking about that. So it is a grind. I hear another puppet. Oh, shit. He come out from behind me. I do not like it. I would let my best friend pee in my mouth once. I would. I ain't gonna pee, pee through my mouth every time. It's so gross. Hey, did you guys see that scary movie where Leslie Nielsen was the president and he peed out his finger? The scary movie 5 or whatever the hell it was. Fuck, I don't remember which one it was. But Leslie Nielsen was the president and he peed out his finger. <sighs> I know most of the places where my buddy, where my buddies is, has been. Well, actually, I don't even have. Hey, this is an adult channel. All right. He just said pee. Hey, he just said pee in my mouth. I don't have to put his manhood in my mouth. <clears throat> Kingy, where do you come up with this shit? Actually, you know what? Don't tell me. Don't tell me. I don't want to know. How about we keep it to like the hundred dollar bills and the toilet that, and stuff like that? You're just getting into some other shit that I don't even really want. Oh fuck me, there's a beeper. 
Get on quickly, quickly, quickly. Oh, I'm gonna get hit. Oh man, I got so lucky. I figured he'd swing on me. I'll try to take out, hey, this is for research purposes. I'll try to run down a heavy. Uh, I'll play scum. I'll have it come to real life in the real world. Because we're probably not too far from it right now anyway. With all the shit that's going on in the world today. You know, uh, that is one thing I will say this, and it's not meant to be political, religious, whatever. It's just stating what I think is reality, and that is we're not that far from what I'm doing right now in this video game. So it will bring it to attention uh, more so, at least amongst the gaming community, that shit like this can and will most likely happen. Oh, by the way, I've thinned the herd of the uh, of the bugs, the fl the bugs that were flying around in here, by like 90% now. I found a couple around the sink uh, earlier, but the majority of them are dead, dead, dead. That little, if I had it to do all over again, I take these plug-in ones. Which, they have been effective, but they're this big, and then the desktop one is this big. Anyway, um, uh, I'm going to have to go with raining marshmallows. The marshmallows, uh, when they get melted and sticky, the Skittles melt and sticky. 600 spiders in your bedroom or 6,000 grasshoppers. I'm going to go with ne neither. We ain't having that. We ain't, we're just going to refuse to do any of it. <clears throat> 6,000 grasshoppers is a lot. I guess, okay, if I, have to, do I ha if I have to make a choice, give me the grasshoppers. <laughs> right. Um... Well, see, you didn't specify, are they the giant locust grasshoppers or what? But I'll take my chances with the grasshoppers, I think, rather than the spiders. Now, where was that beeper at? Look, him swinging on me. Do you see that? Instead of running away, old boy swung on me. This is actually some pretty good research tonight. I just was planning on fucking around. This is actually decent. Now I heard a beeper. There he is. We've definitely activated. Uh, and you know what? You know what? You can eat. You can eat. Uh, there's two beepers here. Man, they're fast. I think there's another beeper up here. Hold on, let's check a look. No, that's not a beeper. He was kind of had a white reflection on him. Yes, they did. They've done all kinds of naughty shit. Yes, they did. These puppets are ferocious on all three servers I play on. Uh, I'll take pizza. But I do love ice cream. But I think pizza is probably better for you long term than the ice cream. I love ice cream. I haven't had any in a long time. There he went. Zombie Land, the movie. I've watched the Zombie Land. Ooh, I'll tell you what. If I had the choice, if I had the choice to pick the five movies. I'll go with the movies. Uh, if I don't have a choice of what the move, oh god. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna play PvP. Uh, yeah. 
You gotta be more specific about some of these things, Kingy. Because... Oh, that's a great Except kids one. falling off bikes, maybe. Fuck, I could watch kids fall off bikes all day. I don't give a shit about your kid. How about kids falling off of dirt bikes? Look at all these puppets! Oh, rawr, rawr. I don't think I'm gonna search all these guys. I'm just gonna run them down. We'll have a little vehicular homicide here. Oh! Stay out of the fence. Hey, I said I was gonna work on dirt bike skill. Do you see he started swinging on me before I even got up there? Uh, in real life it is. I can guarantee I'm to you. I'll eat the beetle. Well, is it stung by two wasps? Two? He said wasp. That's plural. Uh, see, you gotta be more specific about some... I will loot this place now after I've gone through all the work killing these cocksuckers off. This is where it starts getting dangerous, because these are heavies and there's four of them. That one's a lighter one. There's two heavies, uh, a lightweight, and a medium. They're pretty badass. I'm telling you guys, it can be done. If I had to get stung by two wasps and that's it, is that a beeper? No, that's the other dude. That's a medium. Yeah, I used to do stuff on dirt bikes when I was a kid. And, yeah, you can get yourself in some trouble pretty fast. Fuck no, I don't want the website. It's irritating as fuck, Kingy. I don't want to have to think about this shit. is wrong with you? I can't remember this shit. <clears throat> Alright, I... Oh, well... I'm sorry, I wasn't uh, listening. Uh, okay. Since you weren't listening, I said no. Half these things that you, uh, bring up, so they're somewhat amusing, and I suppose they do have a little bit to do with scum. What's up, fucker? Come over here to my window. I'm gonna shoot this dude with the 357. Okay. I'll smoke this fucker. Are you ready? Well, maybe I will. I thought for sure it'd take him out. I can tell you something in real life. There's one on me in real life. You get shot in the head. You get shot in the face with the 357. You are going down. I, I will guarantee you that almost 100% of the time. If you got shot between the running lights with the 357, you are going down. The 357 Magnum is the most dangerous overall powerful cartridge uh we learned about that when i went through medic school but anyway pistol cartridge known to man by by size weight you're basically shooting a, a 125 grain semi-jacketed hollow point or Something around there, 125 to 150, a jacketed soft point. Oh my god. I've killed deer before with a 357 bag. Back in the day, I have shot deer with a 357 bag. Semi jacketed soft points. And they are brutal. Put a little bitty hole in him, about like that. 
but took him down. Oh, there's one more in there. Let me reload. This pistol does take a long time to reload, but it's so cool that you can put the mounting bracket on here, and I was able to do the aim point. And that graphic you guys just saw where he flipped, uh, where she actually flipped the uh, pistol shut, do not do that. That's just for the movies. Do not do that in real life. You could damage your firearm. Close it gently by hand. There's a way to do it. Okay? Do not do that in real life. Okay. That's just Hollywood. Right. Thank you, Carl. That's right. The more you know. The more you know, the more you grow. I've got a thousand fame points. I wonder if I should spend that on anything. I wonder if there's any needy children that need firearms. Number three. There are a lot of puppets. Were a lot of puppets in this building. What did I shoot? Three or four out of here? Three for sure, right? Well, there's two dead ones right there. There's a holster. At 99%, I'm not taking that. I'll move it, though. I like to move it, move it. Let's see what these guys got. What do you guys hold? What I'm going to tell you is, deer season just came in yesterday. I want to go deer hunting. Uh, I don't think so. I think I got it. TV head. Um, the uh, what I'm telling you is deer season came in. It's hot here. It was 81, 82 degrees today. I generally don't like to hunt when it's hot because you got to do something with the deer meat. Not that I can't kill one. You got to do something with it quickly. Uh, I also have training. Holy shit balls. All right, well, I guess I'll drop this 39 and pick up the 50. And um, also, I had one of the places that I put down for a reference contact me today and said that they got... Um, my work uh, reference today. They received it. I was told it was going to take six to eight weeks to get those processed, and it still could, but um, this, this is moving right along smartly as far as the possibility of a uh, hire. <clears throat> So, keep that in mind, that very soon, probably, I'm thinking tentatively in the next few days, there's a very good chance that my streaming will be truncated. Uh, substantially. You like that word, truncated? Look at that. There's a light for a VSS and a Shemog. Giant trucks for the deer car. Yeah, I can do that. I'm not going to do that. The My goal here is not to see how much money I can spend right now. I'm saving. Oh, look. Here's a Peacekeeper 38. Look at that. Now, you can't shoot the 357 through the 38, but you can shoot the 38 through the 357. Now, nah, I'm not carrying it around. I got this 357 Magnum with a red dot on it. That's what I'll be carrying. 
I just figured since I spent all that work running these guys down, and here's another thing, those head sacks pissed me off. If they haven't changed them, you should be able to chop them up. You should be able to make a bunch of rags. Well, actually, let's try it. Let's see if they've changed it. I don't think they've changed it. Where you can chop them up. Nope. You can repair them or equip them. That's it. It's bullshit. It's one of the things that could give you the largest amount of rags and you can't even chop the son of a bitch up. I don't even know what your name is, bud. Yes, you do. What we got here? Piece of pipe, 1911 mag at 38%. Now, hey, you know what it could do? I don't even need that money. <clears throat> I've got 1911 mag, and I say I could use up that toolbox, but let's not do that. Let's not do that. I just repair the mag, uh, and then it'll use the toolbox up, and then I'll go get another one. But in case somebody comes down here, they can get a free toolbox. Mostly free toolbox. Yeah, and you guys, uh, I was told. <laughs> The reason that we have chicken coops down here is so you have target practice on the chickens. Look at this, a Magnum 357, right? Okay, so we're going to set this on the table right there. Now see I have this other Magnum 357, it's at 100%. I could disassemble this. I've got a toolbox on me, okay? I could repair it with the um, weapon cleaning kit. But I don't want to mess with that. I've got another one back in the truck. Okay. But the chicken coop should be able to open that. And I should be able to open that one. Usually you get some feathers and some eggs out of here. How are we doing on food anyway? Well, we're doing really good on food and water. I forgot on this server it's more realistic where you don't have to eat every fucking five minutes. So whoever set this up, damned or Janzer, Gregory, Shaloved, whoever, well done. Well done. It's more fun to play the game than to piss and shit and drink and eat every five minutes. It's not realistic on the other servers that I play on. Okay, look at this. A Spitfire jacket under normal circumstances, that would be the shit. And then if I had an M1911, if I were carrying that, that's what I would do is I'd take this other one for parts. But uh, this is the case where we're not doing that currently. But uh, if you hadn't seen this before, this is a pretty good place to get some lower percentage weapons uh, usually you'll find one or two down here in the hunting stand you'll find some food maybe some drink in this uh, bunk uh, barracks here you might find a couple things up there in those tents on the hill all right and off we go into the wild blue yonder I think oh you know where we're gonna go Guys, it's some place I have not been in a long time. It's dangerous. Just a little bit dangerous. Here's the way I look at it. If somebody told me that I only had a few more days to play scum and I wouldn't be able to play it anymore, please don't be a fence there. I would, I'm going to go do what, what I'm going to do. Because I think that's going to be pretty, pretty realistic. Um, I got the tires changed around on the four-wheeler on the ATV. Uh, that's done. I got to get my mower going. I probably should fix that. I got to fix a tire. I might do that today. I might go out to the farm today and take the mower and the four-wheeler out there. Quite a drive, 45 minutes each way just to do that. But then it would be out there and out of here.
I'll have to get back to you on that. We'll see. How we oh we needed some more fuel. We'll go over here to the gas station. We'll get a little bit more fuel over here. She has been burning through it. I love, 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 love the power lines. And I'll tell you why. I'm going to check this lane stand, too. The reason I love the power lines is not so much because of the power or the the possibility of getting power into the future. The reason I love the power lines is for the travel. And this is like this in real life. If you guys have never lived out in the country where they have the power lines, this is how it is. There's a little puff ball. We'll save that guy. This is how it is. When the, the tree crews come through, they will level. I mean, they fucking level it down to the dirt underneath these power lines because they don't want the stuff growing up underneath there and getting in the power lines. And that makes it so easy to travel. Technically, you're probably trespassing here where they do this um, in real life. But for scum, who gives a fuck? You're a convicted criminal. Alright, but see how clear this is? Unless there's a substation or whatever up underneath there's it's, it's a clear shot as far as traveling across the map. And if you guys haven't noticed, I'm a roadrunner. I'm quite the roadrunner. I was looking for one that has like a, like the little hut, like the little pair. Here's one up here on the right. It's got the little power station in there. You just got to make sure, make sure you don't run into that. <clears throat> Easements for the foliage and the access. Okay, there you go. Thank you, comp. Just try not to run into this shit. Okay, try not to do that. Let's see, I need to go around this corner. See, <clears throat> I'd like to have a dirt bike rather than um, a UTV side-by-side. It's about a third of the price, even for a brand new one. They're easier to transport, um, and they're certainly more maneuverable. The problem is they're now they're noisy as fuck, especially the two strokes. I would probably get a four stroke if I did that. I would get a four stroke dirt bike. Um, I don't want to mix gas and oil and all that shit. I thought maybe there were some puppets here. Let's see if there's any beepers. Say there's a beaver right here. Two of them! <clears throat> Two countries with purple in the flag. Nope, I. Well, I may have known that, but I did not remember it. Knowing and remembering are two different things, Amy. Um, I'm trying to think of what those countries would be. Dominica and Nicaragua. Yeah, die. Yeah. There was back in the old days, like uh, they used to make purple dye. It was from some kind of a mollusk, wasn't it? Like a conch or some kind of a shellfish that they made purple of it. Like, see, I couldn't take these guys on. I could not take those guys on. Ah, uh, there's just too many of them. Whoa! War with ashes! Well, hello, beautiful. Huh. Who are you Who are you calling? You better not be calling me beautiful. Hello! Hello! There's hello. We are not playing chicken attack. Big Shirley. I just came in to get some of the. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, I got hit. I got hit. Look at that. See, I'm bleeding. If you run into a big bunch like that at a lower speed where they can trap you, you are in trouble. 
because they will fuck you up and knock you off the bike and kill you. Matter of fact, I got knocked off the bike and killed right here. Um, there's two things that, uh, me and my buddies have talked about in the past where that will, other than getting run over by a semi or another, another vehicle, a dog or a deer in this area in the Midwest, dog or a deer, you hit a dog or a deer while you're riding a motorcycle, even if it's a dirt bike that has a little bit better traction there's a good chance you might not live through it. Deer are ferocious. What's up, bitch? Doors are closed. That's good. Man, where is this chick? I wonder if she jumped from outside. Or a cow. Well, here's the thing. The cows move slower. The dogs not only chase the dirt bikes, but they also get confused and, and run at them and their timing is a little off someplace and the deer definitely get confused that can definitely happen a moose see again a moose or a cow something bigger like that you might have enough time to react to not get um, not get uh, killed by one. Oh shit 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 okay she's inside all right, we're gonna take a chance on this. Top her off. Black cow. Huh. Uh, me and my two older brothers, we hit a cow. We were going about 55 miles an hour. One of our neighbors when we were growing up was notorious for their livestock getting out, like all the time. That's a fireworks big. Um, and uh, we hit it. We were just going up town to get some ice cream. It was like a little mom and pop place. It was like a Dairy Queen. And um, yeah, we hit that son of a bitch. We hit. I was in the back seat, so I didn't take the worst of it. But my my next older brother, he put his arms up in front of his face like that. The cow smashed in the windshield and he got all that glass they were picking glass out of the back of his arms it it turned his arms into like hamburger but they sewed him back up uh we were in shit what year was that let me think of how old i would have been oh, i was still in high school like 15, maybe? So that would have been 35 years ago. Um, like a late 70s, early... Had to have been late 70s or early... Well, whatever year. It was a Chevy Vega station wagon. So it was a small station wagon. You know, like a Ford Escort station wagon that they used to have back in the day? You know that kind of thing so yeah it was a bad deal 79 silver oh no, no 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 we were in a, it was a car let me see if there's somebody here in the back oh. uh, yes you should be careful with your injuries we went through all that work give me Peter Gabriel here come on give me a baseball bat I want to be your dead hamster. Oh, wait a minute. Sledgehammer. Why don't you call my name? Look at that. A gold 1911, a compass, and a kitchen knife. Kitchen knife is at 49%. Here's another kitchen knife at 49%. Let's go ahead and swap this one out because I don't have any room for any more. Uh, oh, uh, somebody has, somebody has, uh, the damned has a, uh, command for sledgehammer. That's pretty good, that gold 1911, the compass, and the, and the knife, and here I am leaving it all behind because I can't carry it. 
That's one thing about the dirt bike that uh, I believe Janzer is one of the few people that does it. You better just plan on carrying what you can carry. See the vegetable oil up there? We'll see what it is. We'll see what the percentage is. 61%? I'm not taking it. So it uses the Bushman. <clears throat> Out of all these other knives I've got, it takes the Bushman. Perfect. Repair the Bushman. Did you put it back in? Okay, these other knives, I don't care if it uses them up or not. Come to think of it, I may have dropped that hunter knife, didn't I? She gone. It dropped it. I'm gonna drink this cup of coffee. I reckon I'll drink this cup of coffee. Mm -hmm. All right, Dan. I did watch the Sling Blade movie finally, the short one. And I was looking at that girl, and I'm like, that looks like Molly Ringworm. And I kept looking, but it was black and white, and the light was kind of dark. I don't know if that's her or not. But then somebody commented below. I bet she's kicking herself for not doing the big movie. That movie cost 20 something million dollars to make and it made like 130 or 140 million. So that movie did very well. <clears throat> you can look it up, but I looked it up. It was exponential, like six times the production cost is what the movie brought in. Maybe not exponential. Well, it was a multiple. It was a multiple. Should we go up here to this factory real quick and see if we can find a uh, car repair kit to top off the health on this dirt bike? Maybe we'll do that. It's time for show and tell with old Uncle John. Come on, kids. You know what time it is. Now, have you noticed here that this is an addition? Let's see if these gates open up. Sometimes if you drive close enough to a gate, they'll open up. Uh, have you guys seen this? This is new. This wall here and these three open front lean-to warehouses whatever you want to call them three or four of them whatever they are now there's no mechs on here there's three looks like there's no mechs well hello that guy just appeared what's up fucker and then we've got all these garages over here on this side and there should be a hole in the wall right yeah this could be very dangerous just to go for a uh, car repair kit that I don't really need. Hey, but you know what? I have found baseball bats in, in this place before. Are you serious? Six out of ten wire. Well, we broke the eight out of ten wire curse. <laughs> those pants I got tactical pants which in my opinion are the best in the game okay now I have a screwdriver here that's like two out of three let's dump that one and we'll take this three out of three there we go okay she really is carrying more food and drink than she really needs I can tell you that right now because I, I was hoarding all this stuff because of the metabolism. Let's repair. Let's repair the scissors. The question is if I drop the stuff ooh, for the drink, then am I just going to pick up more stuff? The answer is probably. The answer is highly likely yes. 
Um, we're looking good, though. If I find a baseball bat, though, we're probably going to drop that. Sledge. Yeah, I haven't been in here in a long time. You've been going, going, going. You've been going, going, going. You've been going, going, going so long. Look at that shit. 46. What do we got left on this one? 29? Okay, we'll switch that one out for the 46. Well, we are upgrading. And anybody who comes in after me will be happy to find that little toolbox in just about any condition, I reckon. and nails. It's good. We'll try to remember that for later. Alright, my little loot goblins. Three down, three to go. There's a pickaxe, but we're not taking that. We'll keep the sledge. Well, yeah, we'll keep the sledge over that. I do like the pickaxe in certain situations. But if you have a sledge or a baseball bat available, I probably... Oh, keep that. 10 out of 10. We finally found a 10 out of 10 wire, which I'm not going to use. I was just wanted to bitch about it. Uh, we'll throw down this one. We'll take a 49 out of 50 compared to a 46 out of 50. Pretty good loot in here, guys. Pretty good loot. Had to leave two little toolboxes behind. Two out of three screwdriver. Let's go. Either that or she's cold, but it sounds like a puppet. Yep, it was a puppet. Hear that? Now you hear him. And that's another reason. Close your doors. You, you may live to regret it. You may not. He's definitely aggroed on me. And I don't think I can get him with the bow, so let's go ahead with the sledge. I could use the Bushman as well on the other side, I reckon. Yep, Big Shirley. Come on, Big Shirley. I got something for you. Ooh, I'm off. I'm off. Bitch! Not today. Oh, man! Okay, okay, I guess it is today. JCT, well, other than getting roughed up by a couple puppets here, that I hadn't planned on the second one. But truthfully, does anybody really? Does anybody really plan on getting roughed up? There's a bandage. Let's just go ahead and use that to our advantage, shall we? We'll go ahead and use that guy right there. We'll go ahead and treat it. Thank you for the bandage. And I need to eat and drink some more. Uh, negative. I would have thought it would have been yesterday, truthfully. That's what, uh, that would have been my guess. Six, seven. Do I not have a kitchen knife in here? What the fuck? I got a kitchen knife right here. Oh, it's a different style of kitchen knife. All right, we'll go with number nine. Chop, chop. Yep. Okay, anything I want there? Nope. Okay. No baseball bat yet. Damn it. Watch 
watch your back. Oh, look at the close-ups. Big Shirley took a dirt nap. She looks so peaceful there for about a split second. Let's see here. I don't know if this is a safe spot to do it or not. There's a good possibility there's puppets in here, and there are puppets right here. Now, if I do this right, I might be able to go ahead and put the smack down on old boy about right there. There's another one in the back. That's pretty good with no aiming points, just instinctive shooting. Gingerbread man. Nope, evidently I'm not. Motherfucker's fast. God, he fucked me up. All right, well, let's, um, hmm. All right, let's treat. Let's see, what do we got here? I'll use that one up, first of all. Damn it, I did not mean to do that. Let's see if it'll let us finish it out. Yeah, they don't. They don't, really. Uh, let's go in here into crafting. I guess I'll see if there's anything else that I want to chop up. No, we'll just open up one of these cans of whoop-ass here. Down to 9% on my rags. Really? Ain't that about a bitch. Uh, fix that one up. Yeah, that was bad. She needs some vitamins, too. We need some D and K. She needs to get some of that D. That's right, baby. She needs some of that D. Here we go. Oh, yeah. All right, there we go. It happens. It happens. So, like a year ago. Yeah, like a year ago. Well, <clears throat> I'm here to tell you, my friend, the best laid plans of mice and men. And in this, in my case, women. These things happen. Ah, well, you know, uh, right. If you're going to do it, make it worth it, you know? Chop, chop, chop. Uh, bandage. We pull this bandage, we'll take this bandage. That's a free one. I wish you could cut up those bandages, but you can't. Yep. I was, uh, watching another player, uh... What the fuck? Where the fuck do you come from? Three of you's in here? Are you kidding me? I'm gonna kill this one with a kitchen knife. This little crackhead. Let's give her the old one, too. Oh, yeah. See, I figured I could kill this little skinny one with a kitchen knife. I've got advanced melee and 4.5 strength. Fucking right. You're going down, you little skinny bitch. Put some weight on. You don't fuck with my girl. She's thick. 33 kilograms of body fat. That's right. That's right. 33 kilograms. Check this shit out. 
Damn, she's thick. If DJ was in here, DJ would tell you. He likes a girl with a little bit of back on her. Okay, there's an M9 mag and an RAS adapter. That's good loot, but I don't need it. Some 9mm, some hiking boots. Your car is not a submarine. No, that's incorrect. It's not correct. Hey, do I have an arrow sticking out of the wall? There is an arrow right there. Can I have that? Thank you. Oh, please, please give me that. Ba bum bum. Please, please give me that. Are there any more arrows in the vicinity? Yes, there are. Thank you very much. Now, there's a little axe here. Hmm. Do I drop these two kitchen knives and take the axe? I think I do. I think I do. Oh, boy. Should be able to put this little guy right here. Perfect. I think I'm going to do that. Just for shits and giggles. And if somebody comes in here and finds the knife, so be it. They're welcome to it. Lead plate, damned. Fucking lead plate. Lots of bolts. Lots of scrap. A couple nails. I bet I'll find a toolbox. If I find a baseball bat, though... Oh my, an MP5 SD. You guys know I love the MP5 SD. This is a righteous find. It was not spawned in. God, and I don't have room for it. Look at that. That's a beautiful, beautiful submachine gun. I already have one, I think, on this server. Maybe it's on... Maybe it's on the tomorrow night server. I don't know. Um, I'm going to leave it. I love that submachine gun. It's beautiful. Hey, and if you guys haven't researched <laughs> Jesus. If you guys haven't researched that in real life, the MP5 SD is a real thing. There's only, there's, there's, nah. I got a uh, dirt bike. I'm driving a dirt bike. If you guys haven't researched it, the MP5 SD is, is a work of art, basically, is what it is. Um, and it will take any type, oh, there's a puppet back there. Any type of 9mm ammunition and um, make it subsonic. But that's what you get with that fine German craftsmanship. Fuck you, buddy. Um, Heckler and Kulk. I didn't know I was saying it wrong. I thought it was Heckler and Koch. But it's not. It's Kolk. Okay. So that that is not a joke. That is not a joke. It'll take any type of 9mm ammunition, even plus P, I believe. And it'll bleed off the gas. It's got a proprietary system in there. It'll bleed off the gas so it makes it subsonic like a thousand feet per second. So every single round you can mix match. You could load up a 30-round magazine with every other round was a different type of ammo. And it would do it. I think the only problem is if it gets dirty. Right. Cool. Right. So. What's this here? That's 50. Give me that 50. I just found 150. And I don't even need that I got. We're using, see, the little axe here. So we're saving on our Bushman, and works out okay. That's like, I didn't know the VSS, there's a big axe, we're not taking that one. I didn't know the ASVAL or the VSS were real, but they are absolutely real. I think they're a little bit generous on how they rate 
their performance on steel plates and body armor and so forth at 400 meters with a subsonic 200 grain 9x39, but whatever. Those sneaky Russians, you know. <clears throat> Bots of bolts. More M9 stuff. Can't find a baseball bat to save my ass. What do I got for a lighter here? Do I even have a lighter? I'm looking. Am I even carrying one? I guess I better take that then. <clears throat> Under the pastries? Under the pastries? Oh, there it is. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. But this location has got pretty good loot in it. The uh, upstairs on the four stories, you can sit up there and just snipe. And as fast as they respawn on this server, you could have a field day. MP5 SD in real life. I don't even think an average person can buy one. I think it's military and law enforcement only. Look at all this 22 ammo. I'm pretty sure an MP5 SD in real life is law enforcement only. And, and military. Alright, let's see. Which way am I going here? I want to go this way. Actually, I need to drink. Uh, as soon as I get done... Clearing out these puppets in here. Uh, I think they're military and law enforcement only as well. Because they're suppressed. You, well, you'd have to have a permit to have a suppressed uh, firearm. To legally possess one. And you'd have to live in a state, if you're talking about U.S., that that allows that they are cool as shit though I would like to have one not because I want to do anything illegal I would like to have one just because I could say I've got to suppress if I had a choice hmm, that'd be tough if I had unlimited access to ammo and the funds to get it would I take an AS uh, VAL, a VSS, um, or an MP5 SD. Man, that'd be tough. Uh, and I could legally own any of them, but I can only have one. I'd probably take the MP5 SD. If I were legal to possess them, and money was no object, and I could get ammunition, my, actually the ammunition is is probably the big thing because you can get nine millimeter pretty readily compared to the nine by thirty nine. That'd probably be a little more to come up with. Yep, I take the MP5 SD. Uh, now this is yep. This is something I do know a little bit more about. Just figure, look at that, a 20 out of 20 lead plate, 81%. Just figure about 500 US for a Glock. She was under siege for four years. Glock 17. I have a Glock 17 in real life. Uh, now here's the deal. Do we take the little saw or the hatchet? Hmm. The saw's at 88%. will fit right in there. Look at that. Is there anything else I can drop and keep the little hatchet, the little axe? Um. Now the question is, oh, I've got the grinding stone on me, so it'll repair that anyway. I could triple carry the little axe and then just drop it if I have to. Let's get a drink. 
Do I have any of these that are about out of? Uh, let's see here. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll eat this lemon. Let's eat this lemon while we're at it. Two. Yep, that's what I'm saying. Nine mil you could find anywhere and everywhere. Um, now this soy sauce. Let me examine that. Let me see what's in that. It is soy sauce. I could drop the soy sauce. Alright, then I could put this up here. Uh, what we could do is put this barbed wire here and then we could put a little axe right there. I feel okay about that. I feel alright about that. Now, let's see. Uh, yeah. That's good. Ooh, I hear another cover. Alright, what can we do with this little axe? Can I put him in zero? I can. Let's go. Um, there's a Glock. It's a Glock Model 20, I think. And it uses 10 millimeter. Don't quote me on that, but I think it's a Glock Model 20 it uses 10. Uh, there's some Smith & Wesson. Uh, pistols, I believe they also use 10 millimeter. 10 millimeter allegedly was made because it was more powerful than the 45. There was some siege where some FBI agents got the shit shot out of them. I think it was. I think it's all bullshit. Okay, I think it was a made-up story to sell more 10 millimeter. Is what I think. 10 millimeters badass. I, I I'm not sure if a Desert Eagle uses 10 millimeter as well. It is more powerful than the 45. Do you mean to tell me your 45, 230 grain full metal jacket, or like I used to carry Hydra shocks that are jacketed hollow points with a pin in the middle of them, are not going to take somebody down? What I think the problem was is these guys were just horrible shots. <laughs> I. I don't know that that's the case, but they blamed it on the ammunition. They blamed it on the round. I think it's horseshit, is what I think. I think it was a, a bunch of shit so that they could sell more 10 millimeter handguns and 10 millimeter ammunition. That's what I think. I could be totally wrong. Anybody else who's out there in law enforcement? You can get mad at me if you want. I can't stop you, but I still think it's worth shit. It was just an excuse to sell some guns and ammunition. Uh, yeah, lever action rifles are good. Depends on what you're using them for, but a gazillion, million, bajillion cowboys can't be wrong. <clears throat> right. Right. Now, I will tell you this. I've seen some paint jobs. Uh, I'm trying to remember. It was on a Chevy or a GMC truck where the white, it was a white paint, and it peeled off and it revealed the gray primer underneath it. And uh, it was the paint. It actually was the paint, but that doesn't happen very often, but there was a certain batch of this white paint. We got 40 minutes-ish. Yeah, we can do this. Oh, gosh. Guess what I forgot to do, guys. Ah, okay. Well, did he not mix it properly, or what? I don't know. Let's drink. Take a drink. I'm just going to drink all this lime juice. 
Really? Well, that's interesting. You're using the same can, and his... So he put it on too thick. That's the only thing I can think of. He put on too much. Especially if you were rolling it, or if you were brushing it. This is something I have a little bit of experience in. If you were brushing it, rolling it, or even using a spray, a sprayer, he put too much on. <clears throat> you will get some runs. But you know, you can fix that generally. Generally, you can take a clean paper towel, one that doesn't leave a lot of lint, and you can wipe that get the runs out if you get it before it starts to set up you can take the runs out and then go back over it and it's not uh, it's not that difficult you know what i didn't do guys we were just down there how far are we from that factory well i'm at 90 percent all right We'll take a chance on it. We'll take a chance on it. The I was gonna get a look for a car repair kit, and we drove out of there without one. Um, I'll tell you what. Let's do. Let's go straight east. There's a bunch of cargo drops here, and then let's go up. Cause I was gonna go up to D zero anyway. Let's just go uh, see if I can get a car repair kit out of a cargo drop. I'm at 90 currently. What I usually do is I try to prep when I'm painting. I try to prep the surface as best I can based on what it is. Hell no, you're not allowed to own a machine gun. you got to have a class 4 uh, federal firearms. Well, maybe a class 3. Class 3, Class 4, whatever. Federal firearms license. You have to be a dealer that has extensive... Yeah, you could have a rat-a-tat. Actually, you probably couldn't because it keeps shooting arrows when you hold the trigger down on the drill. I hadn't even thought of that. Maybe you can. Okay, I'm gonna go south. I need to go straight south now. We gotta get across this water, and I am not swimming. Yeah, you can make your own guns. It's it's legal to make your own uh, semi-automatic. I think the last I knew can't make a machine gun. At least, not as far as I know you can. I don't, I don't know all the rules about it because I never intended on having a machine gun, so I didn't study it that much. Oh, man. That's a bad deal. Sure there are. You can get left-handed rifles, Kingy. You can get uh, ambidextrous. You can get uh, rifles that you can change from left to right. Sure you can. They're not as popular. Most, most are made for right-handed folks. Almost there. Oh, let's not do that. Let's not put anything in the fire. If we can help. Okay, now I need to go south. Let's try not to do that. have gotten pretty ferocious, my gosh.
Do you think anybody heard me coming? 26 minutes. Let's go ahead and get after it. I've got a 20 out of 20 box of bobby pins, and I'm ready for action. It's unfortunate, but there's a. I mean, war is war is hell. They don't they don't say war is hell for a reason. Uh, I am not allowed to buy any kind of a suppressor. Um, but in in states where they allow them, uh, let's see. What do you got to do? You got to. I know there's a tax stamp. Uh, you got to buy a tax stamp. And there's like a, a waiting, no, not a waiting list. Let me think, what do you gotta do? See, I don't plan on having a suppressor either, so. I've seen it on TV though, hold on, let me think. Look at that, all these screwdrivers and the crowbars. Wow, I'd rather have just one, black and yellow. Uh, you, you gotta have a stamp, which is like 200 bucks. You gotta tell the ATF what you're going to get. I don't know if you have to tell them what kind of weapon you're going to put it on. And then you got to submit. I don't remember what the form is. You got to submit some kind of form. And, well, oh, right, 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 right. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> hey, you know, if it, if it really came down to... The end of the world, zombie apocalypse, scum island, or whatever. Yeah, I wouldn't even worry about it. I get... Oh my god, look at this SVD kit. That's what I would do, is I would just get... Um, I'd get a two-liter bottle and, a, and some duct tape, or a, at least a 500-milliliter uh, and duct tape. Just like in the game. I... You know, I think I probably watched that on YouTube. I think it would work though. I I'm I'm not sure how long it would hold up. Look at that! Ask and ye shall receive. That's what we were after. Let's pick this other one. Let's pick one more. I'm thinking the oil, yes, the oil, I've seen it on YouTube. I know the oil can thing works, not first person, but I've seen it on YouTube, and it does work. Okay, now, here's what we're going to do. As much as I hate to do it, I'm dropping that toolbox, and I'm going to pick up the car repair kit, and this is going to go here, and that one's going to go there. We can pick up the car repair kit. I've got room for one thing. What would I pick up for one slot? Actually, I've got about three slots. Mm, Twelve. I guess I'd pick up these screwdrivers. Three out of three. A watermelon suppressor? I don't know if that's actually a thing. Is that actually a thing? And look at this. I should not have been carrying that needle around. It's a needle. Will that go? Alright, here. Let's put this drink up here in the shirt. Shit. If I have to, I'll just drop it. Oh, fuck it. I'm dropping it. Okay, now. I'll take a 3 out of 3, put it in the combat boots. Put this one, 3 out of 3, in the combat boots. I will repair the combat boots. They've been taking a beating. My waist bag's been taking a beating, too. Alright, and the shirt... Camouflage jacket needs to be repaired. <clears throat> Raincoat needs to be repaired. Oh, I didn't repair this shit after I got uh, beat up earlier, did I? No, sir. Alright, is there anything else that I really want out of here? I guess I could take one more screwdriver. I accomplished the short-term goal, though. That's it. We can't fit anything else in here. I got these spices. Let me fix this. 
Oh, we got one. We zapped one. <clears throat> a silencer and a suppressor, as I understand it, they're the same thing. There is no... Uh, shit. I read an article on this or saw it on YouTube or whatever. There is no pew pew bullshit like Hollywood wants to show you where a 9mm goes pew um, that I'm aware of. Maybe there is. I guess if you put enough work into it, you could quiet it down. But I don't think you can quiet it down where, it, yeah, a pew pew, where it actually makes no noise whatsoever. I don't think that's possible. Okay. Maybe it is. Somebody smarter than me knows how to do it. But don't say. I don't want to know. I don't want to be held responsible. Um, I think it quiets them down, but it does not completely silence them. Okay, I can't poop. Let's see what... Where's her metabolism at for poop? We're at 110% on water, so she's way good on water. Let's eat something. Let's eat this MRE. Let's get let's get that out of the way. But as I understand it, a silencer and a suppressor are the same thing. Maybe they're not, but... Let's see, what was it, the original... The original design was called a silencer, although it didn't silence anything. And then they came up with suppressor, which is more accurate, I think. It does suppress some of the noise, but not all. And decibels. There was another thing about decibels. Like, decibels is an exponential thing. Uh, Relord. One makes the most... Ah, okay. Okay, well, there you go, King. Thank, the, thank you for the follow, and thank you for the clarification. One makes a muzzle flash, and the other one does not. All right. I'll go along with that, because I don't know. Uh, okay. Let's go... Hmm, east. Let's go straight east. Yeah, which, uh, okay, now that you open that can of worms, which one does what? I'm guessing the suppressor suppresses the muzzle flash and the silencer does not. Ah, uh, Google to the rescue, yeah. Ooh. Uh, you got timed out for something. Um... It depends on what you're going to use it for, Kingy. I have a double barrel shotgun. Actually, I have one that's for decoration that I bought at an auction just to hang on the wall, which I don't even know where it is right now. Obviously, it's probably hanging on the wall and I've forgotten. Uh, ooh, this is going to be bad. i got to make it across that river. Hmm. I guess maybe I should go back north. Uh. Oh, yeah, there's a limit. There's a limit of 225 characters. And you can't post uh, you can't post any links either. Only me or moderators can post links. Just give me the heads up in case you were inclined to do that as well. Duck hunting. I've done some duck hunting. I used to do a lot of duck hunting. Um, I used an over and under, which is one barrel stacked on top of another barrel instead of a side-by-side. -side. Well, I've actually used both. I've actually used both key. I prefer the over and under, though, rather than the side-by-side. -side. But a lot of, uh, uh, like, bird hunters, like, uh, land bird hunters. Well, they, some of them prefer the double barrel because you get to swing through you. Boom, boom. And one barrel's a little further away than the up than the first barrel. So you get that swing. 
Just give it a little swing, little sis Nora. Silencer is for the sound. Suppressor is also for the mother flash. Muz muzzle flash, thank you. That's what I guessed it was. I guessed that the suppressor did suppress the flash as well. Ooh, C0, where are we getting? Ooh, this one's just right up the road. We'll go get it. A three-barreled shotgun? I don't know about that, Kingy. Guys, we got 20 minutes left, so I'm not going to have to be able to go up to that POI. There, uh, D0. <clears throat> we'll just... Uh, what will we do? Well, we could go up there and ride around. I don't really need anything from Cargo Drop, though. I've got this uh, repaired. We could go get some fuel. Yeah, we could go get some fuel. We're going up. C0 Pad 6 is a really good gas station. But there are beepers up here. I want you to be aware. There are beepers. <laughs> Gregory! Thank you for the host. Good morning, sir. Hopefully you're doing well. I know what the M82 is. It's in this game, you know. TP for my bunk. Right. Oh, oh, is that what you were asking for? Is that what you were asking for? I need picada for my bunghole. I'm sure that's what it was. Triple-barreled Soviet pistol that was carried by cosmonauts on space missions. It was intended as a survival aid to be used after landings and before recover in the Siberian wilderness. I did not know that. I'm not sure how much smarter. I am the great Cornholio. Oh, I'm a gringo. I have no bunghole. Bunghole. Yes, I think you should. Let's go see what's up here at this, uh, let's see what's crack-locking up here. At this, uh, stand. Somebody had a sign up here the other day. I think it's gone. A gringo? We can allow that. We can allow gringo, can't we? I don't think that's too derogatory. Ah, look at this compound bow and a string silencer this is what I might be using here in the next few days I'll probably use my crossbow though truthfully <clears throat> a musket I have not mm, ever used a musket a silenced musket I don't think that's a thing is it isn't isn't a musket the one with like the pilgrims had with the big bell shaped um, barrel in the front and they just jam all kinds of shit down it and then shoot it? Isn't that like the old blunderbuss? I think it's what they called that. I have a muzzle loader. Yeah, I have a muzzle loader in real life. You literally have to take. The muzzle loading rifle. Let's see, how does this work? I haven't used one in a while. Okay. Uh, there's a plug. And that gets threaded in. And then there's a 209 shotgun shell primer that goes in that. And then you take the powder. Okay, here's how it is. I use three, three, three pellets of triple seven. They're 50 grains each. 
and I drop them down the barrel, they slide right in the barrel, and then I have to take the ram, and I'm using a 338 grain power belt bullet. And you jam that down the barrel. You literally have to push it in with force, and it makes a seal in there. So then uh, my muzzleloader has a hammer on it, Pull the hammer back when you're about ready to shoot. I scoped up. It's a nice, it's a nice rifle. I got like 800, 900 bucks in this thing. Anyway, and um, pull the hammer back when you're ready to shoot. You shoot. The hammer comes down, hits the primer. The primer uh, shoots a small jet of flame out through the block or whatever they call it, the plug. Uh, breech plug. They call it a breech plug. It shoots a, a small jet of flame through that, and then that ignites the triple seven pellets, and then it's black powder, and it uh, pushes the projectile down. And I can tell you, one of the deer on my wall, I shot with a muzzleloader. That muzzleloader, I had just got done ranging him out in a hayfield at 116 yards and I shot that sucker and I went over and looked for him and yeah the old photographers right uh, I um, went and looked for him couldn't find him no blood no nothing so I just let him lay I went out the next morning and found him in like five minutes it was 3.30 in the afternoon. It was still plenty light out. It was just an anomaly that he was up there in this hay field eating hay, eating clover or whatever, alfalfa. What had happened was I shot him kind of at an angle through the ribs, went completely through one side out the other, and I still have the bullet. It was up underneath his skin on the other side. So it didn't have a complete pass through. Uh, it was a good shot, probably... The way he was angled, it was a perfect shot. Um, but I didn't find any blood. And I thought, well, maybe I missed the son of a bitch. I'd sighted it in, I think, at 100 yards. So 16 yards was no big deal. You're not going to get that much drop. I was sick. I didn't sleep that night, hardly. But I went out the next morning. I hunted, didn't see anything, walked up there, and then just went around. He was about 70 yards from where I shot him into the woods. And uh, went and got him. He didn't uh, go into the record books uh, with a firearm, but he would have gone into the record books with a bow and arrow, which I have one of those as well. <coughs> that barely made it. Barely made it. Uh, I think he had to have 125 to get into Pope and Young at that time, and mine was 128 and change. But it still made it. So there you go. Holy shit. Alright, what does that mean? Not kingy translate before Irish... Oh my gosh. There's a beeper. Before Irish decides to uh, give you a timeout. APS underwater assault rifle. Special underwater assault rifle. Now that would be kind of cool. There's definitely at least one beeper here. What I was hoping to do is I'll rip back through here a little ways and then they'll bunch up on that beeper and he'll blow them all up. Let's see if they're coming. Okay, that one stopped. Okay, there's two beepers there. That's what I was thinking. There's two beepers there. I may have to get the fuck out of here. Okay, he started beeping. I wanted to make sure I'd activated that second. Oh! That's gonna leave a mark. Come back this way. Come here and blow up some of your friends, will you? Not me. We're gonna run this little crackhead down. Oh, that's a Karen. There's another one? Holy freaking three beepers here? Oh.
God, we may not really want to be associating here very much. There were three beepers there. Son of a bitch. There's one down. Or that's two down. We need one more. Come on, motherfucker, come on. Whoa. Hey, you guys remember that? That one time I drove right through a beeper and he didn't blow up. I was going so fast. Yeah, Gregory. Wonder who the fuck put all these beepers up on this <clears throat> server, hmm? Gee, I wonder. Why won't you die? Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if Gregory had something to do with that. A wah, 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 wander. All I wanted was a little bit of petrol. Stop in and get a little gas. I mean, fuck. I am increasing my skill, though, a little bit. Oh, my God, there's a silver bot. Go away, snitch bot. Nobody likes you. Yeah, go ahead and growl some more, you prick. I don't know if you guys have enjoyed it, but I've enjoyed it just riding the dirt bike around. I haven't got to ride the dirt bike in a long time. Is she dead? Did I kill Big Shirley? Big Shirley's gone. We're not, hey, we're not going to get into any politics. No politics. Now, we're, we got like 10 minutes left. Let's see if I can window shoot this one right back here. Never mind. Oh, that's bullshit. She hit me that close, that far. That is some bullshit. That is bullshit. That is bullshit. How far she hit me that I'm calling 100% bullshit. Gregory, if you saw that, something needs to be adjusted there. I mean, literally, that far back. <clears throat> That's uh, unacceptable. Come on. If there's anything you can do about it, actually. That's my two cents. You know what? Do, do what you think is best, but I'm saying that's bullshit. We done for metabolism. Okay. Drink the coffee. We're eating the tuna salad. Tossing that salad. What? What? Let's drink two milk. Get some of that vitamin D. Get some of that D. Whoop, whoop. Oh, yeah, yeah, we got this. And we'll take a uh, painkiller. Okay, and she could eat something. What else we got to eat? Let's eat some of this bread. Let's eat two helpings of bread. Have you noticed that where two helpings of bread will not make you throw up now, generally? I better look. Well, actually, I better look. Okay, we're close. Yeah, okay, that's enough of that shit. <laughs> not, no, oh, okay, so it's not you. It, it's not the admins and the server owner. It has to do with the way it was uh, coded this last time. Okay, I got you. I thought it's how you had the puppet set. Uh, 
Uh, huh. Since my baby sent me a letter. Look at this. Full health, full fuel, and full battery. I bet that's not going to last very long. Hey, let's see if there's a baseball bat in one of these cars. Nope. Are you talking about in the uh, gun shop in the big city? The bats, okay, the bats are my personal preference. They're decent, okay? The, yeah, I, I got a gold katana. Legit found one out of a hunting stand. The, uh, I like the bats. They're fast. They're faster than the sledgehammer, and if you do it right, you can one-hit one of the little skinny crackheads, but you cannot, they don't have as much oomph as the sledgehammer, but they're faster, okay? My alarm's gonna go off here in a second. Look at that, I'm glad we didn't hit a tree just then when I bumped the mouse. Told you. Alright, now. Alright, well what should, hey, maybe we should just go put this shit in the garage. Let's see where we're at here. Hey, we can just go Great West. A2. A2. Oh, well, I'm not going down there. We're about done. We are about done. Oh, okay, I got you. Yep, I think I know which one you're talking about. We may have to go down there, but I'm pretty sure starting, let's see, today is, this is uh, Saturday, and tomorrow is Sunday, that's probably going to be my last stream for a while, I think, because of deer season, uh, and then possibly my new job, I think that's going to happen, don't hold me to it for sure, but I've been warning you guys that it was coming, and I'm pretty sure... Sunday stream will be the, probably the last one. For, for a while, if not for just taking a complete break. My problem with Scum is this. Uh, I, at, at least from Scum. My problem with Scum is this. If I can only stream one day a week, I'll have to make a brand new character. And all you guys will watch me do is basically a new spawn. The other option that I have considered, which I've talked quite a bit about. Oh, Gregory. Gregory, have I got something for you. Bam! A fucking bullet rips off part of your head. Your brains are laying on the ground in little bloody pieces. Now I... <clears throat> there you go. You can do it. You made the effort. Blood in pieces. Now I ask you, would you give a fuck what kind of pants the son of a bitch who shot you was wearing? Huh. Fairies wear boots. I would care. I would care then. But anyway, uh, Far Cry 6 is probably what it's going to be. That's probably what it's going to be if I come back to uh, streaming. And again, if I got to go to the academy, I'm only going to have two days a week where I can do anything. And I may want to spend them hunting. I don't know. 
But Far Cry 6 would be something I could just pick up anytime I wanted to. Because I will not co-op that, even though I think it is allowed to co-op. I would not play that with anybody else. Uh, and the Horizon Westward Bound, Westward Expansion, or whatever the hell that that is. Uh, I think that that's only for the PS5 right now. I don't recall that that's for the computer. If somebody knows about the new Horizon Zero Dawn uh, game with Aloy, uh, you can please send me a message on that. But it's probably going to be for a crisis. Alright, let's do a little cross country here. The motorcycle is great for the cross country. See that? If you did that in the truck, it would make that noise, like when you crash into something. That is exactly what would happen. So here's what we're going to do. We're almost to quit. Oh, we're not quite quit. Oh, now we are. Uh, in the trailer? Yeah. Well, this is a motocross kind of bike, and the other one's kind of a hell bike. Yeah. Yeah, well, what got me is who the fuck put a green Christmas tree? There has to be a joke to that. That has to be an inside joke amongst the devs or something. First of all, the Christmas tree. And second of all, on an older style bike, you're going to be, well, no, on the older style and the newer style, unless you make a change to it specifically, you're going to be running the throttle with your right hand. It's going to be very difficult to drive that dirt bike with a pistol in your right hand and control the throttle and steer. Yes, what is it, Brick? I would like to extend to you an invitation to the pants party. Excuse me? The party. The pants with the pants. Party with pants. Brick, are you saying that there's a party in your pants and that I'm invited? That's it. I don't think Brick knew we should if, party. <laughs> right. Party. I don't know if Brick knew if he was fishing or cutting bait. That's what I'm gonna say. I liked in the second one where Brick was at his own funeral. I like that. He he was convinced he was dead. And then they had to convince him that he was alive. That was kind of funny. So what we're going to do, I thought about locking this uh, motorcycle up and locking the garage up, but I think I'm going to take a little bit of a different approach. As you see, I got up to 64. 64. Alright. Oh, hey, let's see if we can jump the guardrail on the motorcycle. I know you can do it on the car car in the truck. Well, that slowed things down. Oh! We're gonna say no. You should not try to jump the guardrail on the motorcycle. Maybe there's a better spot. You can do it in the truck, or you used to be able to do it in the truck. But not on the dirt bike. Mm, that sounds bad. Kingy, I think you're in timeout from the pants part. I'll put this right up here where someone can find it. Ooh, there's puppets up here. There's a lot of puppets up here. <coughs> okay. Let's maybe go with this garage back here if there's no puppets up here. Ooh. <coughs> 
Oh, and a hiking backpack in there, too. Look at that. No, I do not want to see your bread stick. And there we go. And this is a vehicle spawn point sometimes, anyway. So no one will even know. And there's no, you know, there's no inventory in it. Here's what I'll do. I'll put that gas can inside the hiking backpack. Oh, and I can pick it up in my hands. I could do that, but I'm not going to do it. It'll only last for so long, though. And then somebody will have it. I could log out with it, but I'll donate this. Uh, let's see here. All right, here's what I'll do. I'll take this just in case, just in case I do come back for some reason. Uh, I will leave the dirt bike and the hiking backpack and the gas can. I'll log out with everything else. Otherwise, if I come back in, I'll be naked. Then it will be like I'm a new spawn. So let's just not do that. All right, here we go. Let's go to the main menu. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, I will say the last uh, eight months or so, a lot of you have been very faithful in the stream, and I appreciate that very much. Uh, I am planning on doing one more, which will be on Mankind's Betrayal uh, tomorrow night. That's the plan, anyway, tentatively. Uh, but we're going to go raid somebody. We're going to pass the love on, and I would ask you to watch them for 15 minutes. If you like them, please give them a follow. If you don't like them, go watch somebody else. I suspect there's a ton of streamers on right now. Let's just find out. Let's just find out who's on. Let's just find out <clears throat> how many people are on. Let's look at uh, browse. 407. 407. Uh, man, I've got certain information, all right? Man. Certain things have come to light. and Man. You know, has it ever occurred uh, to you... That uh, instead of uh, Milf is on, we you know, running go, around we right uh, uh, blaming me, you know, given the nature of all this new shit, you know, it, 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 this could be a, a, a lot more uh, 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 complex. complex. I mean, it's not yeah. just, it might not be just such a simple, uh, uh, you know? What in God's name are you blathering about? Uh. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to make a oh well here's somebody who's new I was gonna say I'm gonna have to pick amongst all the people locos on here's somebody new maybe I can just uh, avoid all that I'm trying to pick one person this person's affiliated I'm on a commercial that's good uh, they've got 35 followers Let's see how we do. I'm on a commercial still. God, look at all the skulls there. That looks like, that looks like a, oh, that looks like Satan. I was gonna say, that looked like a death claw. Come on, let's go. Oh, for fuck's sake. Am I still on a fucking commercial? see if they're talking to the chat like there might be some good loot in there but it also might be my death yeah all okay. right, we'll give him, we'll see if he's got alerts going any suggestions thank you so much for the follow you are welcome you're gonna like the raid here in a minute okay. you're gonna like the raid here in just I don't a have second too much stuff on me anyway so <laughs> let's do it let's start the raid uh should we take the car six seven ten Probably looks like we, we got cry. ten eleven twelve Hopefully. looks like twelve of us let's do it thanks guys Holy crap, 
Thank you so much. <coughs> Thank you for the raid. <laughs> Damn, that's awesome. Welcome, guys. Oh, thanks for the follow. Awesome. I think that's the first time I've been raided. <laughs> that's so cool. Thank you so much. That's awesome. <laughs> Ah, that's so awesome. Thank you so much. We can see the city. Ah, let's go for it. Ah, cool. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's stop recording.